Hello, this is Hakuta Bean in, and today we are actually just staying here. What I'm here to talk about is a show that I actually had to watch over a few days this week, just so I knew what the heck I would be talking about when I did this video. Because I actually have never seen the Angel Genesis Evan Gunning before, or, or this is last week. So I don't quite have the same 90s context that probably a lot of original viewers and fans of this show had. And I probably don't have 20 years of experience with it having seen this extremely distressing show to go along with this view, with this review. So I can only assess it based on what I've seen and what I know. And because it's a review of the show and not the movies, I did not watch those movies. I was about to, but then I remembered I I, I have to do the show before I uh, before I watch the movies. There will there might be reviews for the movies in the future though. For now, what I've seen of the show is the entire anime series, the twenty six episodes of Neon Genesis Evangelion, and the anime that I saw which I watch on Netflix because I do not like to pirate, if I can help it. The show is about a 14-year-old old, old boy. Most of the character, a lot of the characters are actually around that age. It makes a lot of things really uncomfortable. Anyway. A 14 year old boy named Shinji Ikari. And about how much he hates piloting the giant robot. And also about these kids fighting giant robots to fight what's called angels, which are eldritch monsters that. Yeah, they kind of resemble biblically accurate angels, to be honest. Anyway. <laughs> this kid uh, hates going to the robot, but he does it because he wants to be praised by people around him. I'm going to say right now, I actually enjoyed watching this show a lot more than I was anticipating for a show that is uh, probably at least 20 years old by now it did it, it turned out way better than i expected although the show apparently takes place in 2015 and everyone's still using um like nokia's <laughs> That almost took me out of it, but then I remember the show is from the 90s. That's probably the most advanced one they had at the time. Anyway. I don't plan for this to be a very long video because I don't know what I'm actually doing. Basically, the show starts off with Shinji a, a getting... Um, basically hired by a company called Nerve which is spelled like the nerves you have in your body but just missing the second E really weird I know hmm. which is where his father who abandoned him when he was a young child works I don't know why Shinji, and it, Shinji was banned by his father. It's kind of confusing. And honestly, with how, how my sleep schedule has been, I might have 
of slightly tuned it out while half asleep. I think it was Ruben by his father after his mom, Yui Iikari, he passed away. Back on topic, the show is 26 episodes of a 14-year-old going through and dealing with trauma. I like the show for the most part. I did not like how the show ended with just, oh, we're going to get super psychological, then suddenly, poof, everyone's just going to congratulate you for accepting this weird fake world. It's weird. I think that's all I have to say other than I guess the show is... 7 out of 10. Not bad. Anyway, if you enjoyed this video, please leave a like on the video, comment down below, and subscribe to the channel. Maybe give the video your own rating. Tell me how I did. <laughs> nah, I'm kidding. I already know it's a, it's a 1 out of 10. I'll get into more normal red content tomorrow. Until then, Goodbye.